Hey guys, thank you very much for joining. Uh, today we're going to go over a Christmas song by Dave Matthews. Uh, I like to always try to do at least one Christmas song uh, during during the Christmas season. Um, I was actually going back and forth between this one and uh, Christmas Card from a Hooker in Minneapolis uh, by Tom Waits. Um, decided to do this one. I might still do the other one as well if there's any interest in that one. Um, but this is a this is a great a great uh, great song. Great little um, easy finger picking song. Uh, this is probably the first Dave Matthews song that I that I learned years and years and years ago. Um, so this is a fun one. Not too terribly difficult. Uh, got a little bit of a stretch in there, but uh, we'll work through all that. If you're new here, please consider subscribing, hitting the bell for notifications. I do greatly appreciate it. Uh, if you're returning and if you like these videos, please leave a like, comment below, um, just to let me know what you like, what you don't like, anything like that. Like I said, we've got a little bit to, to a little bit to dig into here, uh, so let's go ahead and hop in. Okay, so for Christmas song, we're going to start with this riff that is played throughout the majority of the song. Okay, uh, so starting here, index finger is going to be on the fourth fret of that D. Uh, ring or pinky will be on the seventh of the G. It's a little bit of a stretch. Um, and we're going to pluck with our thumb and index finger. Okay. So we're going to, as, uh, simultaneously as we pluck, we will slide our index finger from this fourth fret to the fifth fret. Okay. Okay. So it'll be, and then we'll move it back and we'll pluck again. So. And then from here, we'll just do open, pluck of those two strings. And then same uh, same riff, just different strings. Now we're on the D, and, or sorry, now we're on the A and the D string here. But again, it's exact same. So index is on that fourth fret, uh, pinky is on the seventh. Then open again. And then it kind of resolves here. Uh, with um, index finger on the second fret of the A and pinky on the uh, fifth fret of the D. Okay, so again. So you just want to do that over and over until you get used to being able to move back and forth um, without really thinking about it. Okay. All right. So from there, um, so the during the verse it will be. For that piece there, which is really just a, a, a D to a C, uh, but all we're doing here: index finger, fifth fret of that A, ring finger, uh, seventh fret of that D. Just again plucking with the thumb and the index. So we're going to pluck here, and then we're just going to shift it up to the uh, root note here on the third fret, which is your C. So. Okay, um, so you go through um, through through the verse progression that way. Uh, and then the chorus, um, okay, and there's one other section, I think the only 
go through this maybe once uh, in this song, um, and it's... Yeah, so that uh, that section happens, uh, I believe it's after the second course. Um, it's, I, I guess you would consider it a bridge. It, it's a bridge, a uh, little bridge version. Um. And again, right back into the verse. All right, so that is that's the Christmas song. Um, like I said, it's a it's a great great little song. Great practice, just a different, just a very different style, uh, you know, of playing. Um, no no real strumming or anything like that, and it's not your traditional finger picking either. So I think it's a really good, really good song to pick up if you're looking for something different to do. But I hope this helps you guys out. Please leave any feedback, comments below, and I'll see you guys again soon.